Stop me if this is incorrect. Farouk Abajir and the PLR seize power in Iran almost the same day as the earthquake. They become a threat. A few weeks later, we send in 50,000 Marines to take them out. We go to war in Iran. Is this a history lesson? What part did you play in going after al-Bashir? That's a broad question. Well, then I will narrow it down. Your first mission. Initially, I rose to do BDA after airstrikes in the northern quarter of Tehran. Battle damage assessment. Why are you doing that? It was procedure. We are looking for a high-value target fast air was supposed to hit. So far as I can tell, you don't have a great history of following procedure. Tell me about your interaction with Lieutenant Colby Hawkins. She was an F-18 pilot. She? Don't know her. As you went in, she took part in an airstrike on al-Bashir. Hawkins, we just got raised to alert one. Plans have changed. We're launching now. CAG says we're special today. We're not on station for some whiskey delta ground support. Dask is going to fill us in airborne, but we are flying a strike mission over Tehran into Maribad Airport. Eland has sat images. They think they know where Al Bashir is. Okay, let's rock and roll.
Roger. Zero four zero. Watch for traffic with Cedar Wind. Two out. Six, you are approaching glide path. Slightly out. Course correcting at three miles. Shark four six, two miles out. Shark four six, got your hook down, looking good. You got the ball. Shark four six, on glide path, on course. Put him on. <laughs> 